Alrighty, thanks for joining me in yet another exercise wherein I will be reading a paragraph to you and embedded within the, well, the paragraphs that I read to you are the potential for errors related to grammar, punctuation, syntax, and so forth. Uh, be on the lookout as you listen to me read it to you. After I'm done reading it to you, I'm gonna go ahead and step out of frame such as I'm doing now and ask that you pause the video to make corrections independently. Once you feel as though you've exhausted all the potential corrections as far as what needs to be corrected, please resume so that you and I can make corrections together. Uh, I am hoping that you find this video helpful or this exercise helpful. Please give it a like if that's the case and subscribe should you want to continue to practice with me. Uh, so starting at the beginning, we have, I can't, Vinny, said Eddie. I know that guy and he's tough. Besides, I don't have time. I have to go home and work on my campaign. Did you forget that I'm running for student body president? The election is next week. I can't believe you won't back me up on this, Eddie, said Vinny. Sorry, Vinny, I have to get home, Eddie replied. As Eddie hurried home, Vinny went to the principal's office to report the vandalism. Later that afternoon, he talked with his mother about what had happened. She shared Vinny's disappointment in Eddie. Alrighty, uh, go ahead and pause here to make those corrections and resume once you feel like you're ready to correct with me. <clears throat> Separate this. Okie dokie, I'm moving so you've hit play and I'm really hoping you can read that. All right, so it's right at the beginning. I can't, and here we have the contraction of can plus the word not. Don't forget when you're joining not to a word as a contraction using an apostrophe, the apostrophe sits between the N and the T to replace that letter O. So I can't, Vinny, said Eddie. I know, oh, we've close quoted, yet contextually I can tell that uh, Eddie, in this case, is not finished speaking. So I'm going to go ahead and open up those quotes. I know that guy. And he's, once more, we have a contraction, or at least we should have a contraction. He is. So apostrophe S. Yes. He is tough. He's tough. Besides, I don't have time. I have to go home and work on my campaign. Not the right, actually, this is not a correct word in general. So this is C-A-M-P-A-I-G-N. Did you forget that I'm, once more, a contraction, I plus the word am, I apostrophe M, running for student body president? And he's asking him, right? It's an interrogative. So we're gonna end, not with a period, but with a question mark. The election, one L, is next week, close quote. I can't believe you want or won't, really, will plus not, so we're, Joining that, the apostrophe sits between the N and the T, as I mentioned earlier. Back me up on this, Eddie, said Vinny. Sorry, Vinny, I have to get home, uh, comma, Eddie replied. As Eddie hurried home, Vinny went to the principal's office, not a multitude of principals, this is not a plurality. We want the singular possessive, so apostrophe S, to report the vandalism. Al Davis, please come to the office immediately, Al Davis. <laughs> Sorry, this is a school. All right, later that afternoon, comma, he talked with his mother, which should be lowercase, it's a general noun. So I'm gonna reduce that down to the lowercase, about what had happened. Uh-oh, happened, H-A-O-O, H-A-P-P-E-N-E-D. She shared Vinny's, again, not a plurality of Vinny's, but a singular possessive. It's his disappointment. So apostrophe S in Eddie, period. All righty. Uh, once more, I hope you found this video helpful. If that is the case, I ask that you please give it a like. Help me out a lot. Subscribe should you want to practice with me again. All right. Thank you again. Hope you have a good day. All right.